Vegetative propagation is the process by which a new plant develops from any vegetative part of a plant. By vegetative part, I mean any part except the flower and the fruit. So we've discussed about vegetative propagation and its two types. Naturally produced vegetative propagation and artificially produced vegetative propagation. In this lecture, we are going to talk about artificially developed vegetative propagation. If you want new rose plants in your garden, what you can do is you can cut stems from an existing rose plant, plant these stem cuttings in the soil and within a few days you will get a lot of rose plants. So the process of cutting of stem and then sowing it, sowing it on the soil to produce a huge number of plant is known as cutting. Have you ever tasted sugar cane? So is sugar cane a fruit? Well, it is not. It is actually the stem of a plant. So since it is the stem, we can say that the sugar cane, the part of it that we have is a vegetative part of the plant. So do we have to take the entire stem, plant it elsewhere to get a new sugar cane plant? Well, no. We need only a small portion of the stem. Now, which portion do we have to take? Well, if you notice you will see that the stem have many structures known as the nodes. This folded structure that you see, they are known as the nodes. And adjacent to the node is a bud. So you need that portion of a stem that contains at least one bud. So if you cut a sugarcane plant or a sugarcane stem from here and plant only this portion in a soil, then you will get a new sugarcane plant from the bud. Now let us see vegetative propagation in sugarcane through stem cutting. This is the node and this is the bud. So we cut that portion of the stem that has at least one bud and sow it in the soil. See a new plant is developing from the bud. Now let me ask you this question. Ravi has a flower shop. He has only two China rose plants with him. But he gets an order of 200 China rose plants which he had to supply within two months. So what is the shortest way of supplying this order? Should he wait for the fruit or should he revert to cutting? Which one do you think will require lesser time? Well, definitely cutting will be a lot easier and it will take a lot lesser time. Because cutting is essential for multiplying the number and fulfilling the market demand. <laughs> 